Ben's idea of doing a, a weekend vlog, since I don't film everything, there's always certain little random things in the shop that you do that we don't film. So, one of those things is all little random projects like the knife I made last weekend. Well, pulled the handle off, made a new handle, heat treated it, tempered it, sharpened it, and the guy at work wants to buy it. So I film that, I'll show that, but it's all the little things like that that we do on the weekends that don't get seen or just things like this. I picked up these little organizers at Walmart. I'm going to use for all my little leather stuff. All the little ideas that we have that we don't really film, other people don't film. Little stuff. Little things help sometimes, so I don't know. We'll go over a couple things and we'll see how you guys feel about a weekend vlog type idea. So currently I use all my leather stuff. This is an old first aid kit that I spray painted. I just got stuff all over the rivets. Compass, hammer, the tools. Well, I saw all these, they're only 20 bucks. I thought they'd work pretty good. So for me, I'm very OCD. So this is all over the place. I don't like it. I can't stand it. What's cool about these is it's got this little tray. We put all the rivets and stuff in here. I can take the ones out of the other ones and stick it in there. That way I can get this all nice, neat, and organized. But while I do that, I'll go ahead and show you the quick clip of me heating and quenching that blade. So, check it out. Alright, so there we go. I mean, I don't have a lot of leather stuff. I got some rivet stuff, needles, and then in the bottom, hammer, thread, compass, um, hole punches, I guess you'd call them. I don't really know. I don't know a lot about leather work. I'm just starting out. So, I was just tired of everything kind of being a mess in this other one, so this works out perfect. And I got all four of these. These are only 10 bucks at Walmart, so that works out perfect. And I got these left over for other stuff. So, another idea if you're like me, OCD, gotta be organized. Little things like this make a world of difference. Here's a set of benches. I had a customer order. Um, I don't know if you call it mortise, whatever, but I have an inset in the legs there, a brace going across. Now on top, this is a 2x6, this is a 10 to get a full 16 inch wide. Screwed it, plug screws. They've been sitting here for a week and waiting for the customer to find the, the right stain they want to use. It's actually really hard to find. But I was going to film this project, I had some troubles, and just stopped. I was getting frustrated. I'm a sucker for toys, I can't help it. These are only two bucks on sale, so I grabbed a couple. Got that one. And this one. So, red suit, black suit. I don't know. You guys have seen some of my videos, seen some of the toys I got all over the shop. You know, why don't we just show it off real quick? Show you some of the toys I have. So I know I've showed these before, all my Star Wars stuff. I just recently took the big AT-AT 
and ATST I had up here, and I moved them in my room on my bookcase. And I redid some of this stuff. All of those, they're all Comtech figures. I picked up at a thrift store, they're only two bucks each. And I even found the Darth Vader lightsaber. There's only a couple bucks. The main thing I'm into is micro machines. Those are all in the package, still new. And that one I found at a thrift store for three bucks. These other ones I picked up at my local comic book store for a good price. I'll take you in the room and show you the others. I made a little shelf for them. Mainly just to show you the shelf. Alright, so here's the shelf. I got Purple Heart inset into this alder wood. wood, alder wood. These are all loose figures. I glued them in place. I think it turned out pretty cool. Let's see if we can get in closer. Yeah. If you remember these bookends I made last May, there's ATAT, -AT, Darth Maul lightsaber. Those are all just hilts from the cheap stuff. That's my books. Those are graphic novels. These are all Star Wars novels. Those are all Spawn. VHS movies. Yeah, VHS. What you got on that? You jerk, you know that? That's funny, haha. Ha. Talk to camera, make fun of me. So the knife is completely done. I didn't film film sharpening it, but it's not a big deal. I use this little guy, the micro bevel. It's not it's not a promotion paid thing. It's, this thing works really nice. Um, I got this off the tool truck, but I think you can get these at Rockler. I think they're less than 50 bucks. And they work really well. But it's nice and sharp. I redid the handle on it. If you remember when I did it, the handle was only like that big is a piece of crap. So, pinned it, epoxy. This is just some walnut cutoffs that I glued together. So, it's my first big knife, and I think it came out pretty cool. I'm no expert, but I like it. So, like I said at the beginning of the video, this is just kind of like a, a shot vlog for the weekend. Certain things I didn't film, some stuff I want to show, organizational ideas, just the little things like that. that I don't normally film during the week or when I'm in the middle of a project or projects that don't get filmed like for instance um, I don't think I filmed this one this is just a little guy and the sheath I made for it it goes like this sideways so you can put it on your back it's kind of like a concealed one I don't think I filmed this one this is a cool little Tanto style I might have I don't remember I did film this one, and I went back and remade the sheath, because I ended up slicing right through it. I might have already mentioned that, I don't know. Or like, this one I made, there's another file knife with a maple handle on it. All the little things like that that you don't show, so that's kind of what this is. Maybe we can get some other guys on board, you know, a recap of your weekend or a recap of your week. I hate to call it a vlog, more like a shop update of things and stuff like that, but I didn't have a project planned, so I figured this would be kind of cool. A couple ideas here and there. And the storage ideas, little metal boxes like this that you find at a thrift store or yard sales. Little things like this can make a big difference. 
This you could store a bunch of little knives in it or small leather cutoffs. Lots of little ideas. So I think let me know when we get some feedback. That's a cool idea. Should I start doing that? And there's a lot of little things I don't film that I'd like to show, but I'm not sure how to do it. So I figured this might be the perfect way to do it. So thanks for watching.